Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to first look at Arsenal and Leicester City holding talks with midfielders agent and deal could cost £10 million plus and then we're going to look at Arsenal defender William Saliba handed one month suspension by French FA over X-rated video. So the first transfer headline states that Arsenal and Leicester City hold talks with midfielders agent and deal could cost £10 million plus. So the reports are stating that Premier League duo Arsenal and Leicester City have both held talks with the agent of Empoli midfielder Samuele Ricci as reported by Tutor Mercato Web. He may be just 19 but do not make the mistake in assuming the Serie B starlet would be moving to England to play reserve team football. Ricci, an Italy under-21 international, is a seasoned pro already featuring in 32 of potential 33 games for an Empoli side cruising at the top of the second tier table. A battling, belligerent central midfielder, Ricky is just as comfortable breaking up play with a thudding challenge as he is carrying the ball through the lines. The 6 foot 1 inches Tuscan born enforcer also has 4 assists to his name during a breakthrough 2020-2021 campaign. So with Orsa and Leicester City making their interest known and holding talks with Ricky's agent, don't be too surprised if the young Italian is playing Premier League football on a regular basis next term. Especially when you consider that in Mikel Sessa and Brendan Rodgers, the Gunners and the Foxes both have coaches who have proven themselves more than willing to give youth a chance. Sky Italia reported last summer that RB Leipzig, AC Milan and Fiorentina had all shown an interest, while Napoli made a £10 million bid. You would assume that after a highly impressive campaign, Ricky may be worth even more than that these days. Speaking last week, Empoli owner Fabrizio Corsi admitted that he was desperate to keep Ricky for another year as the club prepared for life back in Serie A. So it looks like the Gunners and Leicester City are both holding talks with midfielders agent and it could cost more than £10 million. And it looks like both Arsenal and Leicester City are holding talks with Samir Le Ricky in terms of trying to bring him to either Arsenal or Leicester City. And in terms of Samuele Ricci, he is someone that plays in the midfield for Empoli in the Serie B. But it looks like he is just 19 years old, but we shouldn't make the mistake that in, in assuming that this Serie B starlet would be moving to England to play reserve team football because he's already an international under 21 and he also is a season pro already as he is featuring in 32 of potential 33 games for an Empoli side cruising at the top of the second tier football. In terms of my opinion, I seriously don't know anything about Samuele Ricci, but he looks like a decent midfielder because the Gunners are looking for youth to try and get these cheeky deals where it's £10 million or £15 million in a youngster, try and bring him to the Emirates or try and bring him to Leicester City and try to... Get the best out of him at a club where there's a lot of youth with the Gunners having a lot of young players developing at the squad. He would be a perfect addition to make sure that midfield has a massive overhaul in the summer transfer window. And this nicely takes us on to the second piece of news which states that Arsenal defender William Saliba has been handed a one month suspension by a French FA over X-rated video. So the reports are stating that Arsenal defender William Saliba has been handed a one-month suspended ban after the French Football Federation opened an investigation into an X-rated video that circulated on social media. Although the video was initially posted and then deleted on Saliba's Snapchat, the clip resurfaced earlier this year and was widely shared on social media. The FFF immediately set up a disciplinary commission to investigate the video which is considered harmful to the image of the federation and of football as a whole. Now RMC Sports report that the commission have reached a verdict handing William Saliba a one month ban from selection for the French national team at all age groups over the video. Though it has been suspended meaning he will not face any time on the sidelines. Another Premier League player, Brighton teenager Ulrich Enime Elia, was also punished for his role in the clip and has been handed a three-month suspension, only of which is suspended. The punishments for both players will take effect from the starts of next week, Monday, April the 26th, and the player have been warned about their conduct. 
William Saliba will not be suspended from playing for Nice, where he has been rebuilding his career after returning to Ligue 1 uh, on loan in the January transfer window. The 20-year-old has started 15 of the 70 league matches Nice have played since he joined the club and after refinding his match sharpness, the youngster has delivered a series of strong performances alongside Barcelona Loni Jean-Claire Todibo. A £27 million signing from Saint-Étienne, William Saliba will be given another chance to prove he deserves a spot in the first team at Arsenal over pre-season this coming summer. However, he has some bridges to build with manager Mikel Arteta having hit out at his treatment after leaving the club on loan and saying the Arsenal boss judged me on two and a half games. So it looks like Arsenal defender William Saliba will be handed a one-month suspension by French FA over X-rated video. And I thought it was very disturbing from William Saliba to even release that video in the first place, to even have that mindset to do that three years ago was something which I didn't find acceptable. And I thought that William Saliba was getting into the news for the wrong reasons at that moment in time. But I think he's clearly improved massively. You can clearly see that he's been a strong, strong player for Nice. And he only will have a one-month suspension from the French FA, meaning that he will still be able to play for Nice in the matches to come and try to get back that match sharpness. He has been already recovering and try to be that decent that decent defender he is. And he's clearly showing that he's someone to really difficult to get past as no one has dribbled past him so far, so far he has been at Nice. So you can clearly see this guy has the talent, the ability, but he was in the news for the wrong new for the wrong reasons, as I first discovered three or four months ago. But I think it's fair to say he deserves that one month suspension. And all he can probably say is the fact that nothing was related to his games in the league, and he should be happy about that decision. And in terms of my opinion, I think William Saliba has all the ability to start performing more better at the club, to have the opportunity to come back to Arsenal. But other than that, guys, remain blessed. Stay tuned for the next video and peace.